Okay, so I usually don't do harvest videos because it's only two of us, but I do harvest uh, and I harvest quite a bit. So I thought I would share with you all some of my harvest. And now I'm just going in for the basil because I use this for a lot of different things and uh, it's going to seed. So I do not want to lose a lot of it. And the thing about basil is that it actually still tastes the same. And this is rosemary and sage. The sage is not really like it under here, but it's alive for now. It looks like I might have some cucumbers coming soon. Got another okra. Okra takes longer than I thought it would up here, but it tastes really good. And my watermelon, my one lonely watermelon, she's still there. And I have started some more melons too. And this, you guys, I finally have a bell pepper. I'm so happy. It looks like I may have a lot of them coming. I don't know what's going on with this plant. It's shriveled up, but it's producing. And I wanted to remove the others, but nobody ever came to get them. And they seem to be producing too, so I'm just going to see what happens. I know it's too many in this bucket, though. I definitely won't do this again, but I am enjoying this. Really happy about that. And over here, the celery from the store is still good. My potatoes are having a hard time. You know, it's a lot of bugs out here this year. And I think those sweet potatoes might be ready soon, but uh, I'll leave them there a little longer just to see my little bushes i need to come out here and get some of that cabbage too really soon actually and this is a great vine remember when i moved it i moved it to see if it would like it and it obviously likes this spot a lot better because it's actually starting to vine and i am incredibly happy about that that's my sage and my rosemary. And this is a little celery and a little onion. You know, it's just two of us. I don't need a lot, but it's what I do. And that's the basil that I ended up with. And I also took up the garlic that I had. It was really small, uh, but it also was not the right time of year for it. And I got back a lot more than what I put in. And of course, I have these. This has been like the greatest thing so far. And they lasted a while and they still producing too. And so I ended up with this and the Parmesan chicken. I also realized I forgot to show you all how it looked at the end. So this was my lunch the next day. I took my leftovers from lunch. We don't waste food. And this is what happened on the front porch. Or should I say this is what's left over. Echinacea, a couple of lavenders trying to recover. Spearmint, pineapple top, and chamomile from seed. And my little bitty pineapple, you remember? I started with the little baby. Well, I'm getting somewhere, so you know, it's not all bad. They did turn my sunflowers into a litter bucket, but that's okay.